Uh, yeah, we're, uh, recording live. Uh, this is a tape recorder. Uh, I'm pretty retarded. Uh, one, uh, one second. Okay, pressing the record button when there is already a recording will add to the recording, not overwrite it. Uh, of course, that's what I expected. Getting back to the shitty weirdness. I'm stopping. We are at... Almost 30 seconds right now. Let's start the beat. I guess, uh, <clears throat> uh, what do I usually say? Uh, fuck, the Jimmy James show. That's not it. It is now time to explain to people just what's wrong with me. That's a lovely, lovely voice. Oh, thank you. All right, so we're, we're testing on, um, the fuck, uh, what app is this? Yeah, so, alright. You've now tuned in to the blue. Ah, fucking wires caught. Alright. This. Maybe I shouldn't be holding both things. Oh, fuck. Alright, so. I'm still doing it. That's. Yeah, maybe my iced tea next to all these electronics is not a good idea. Okay, so what's coming up is. Um. Basically, what I'm doing, I'll have... This is going to be a fucking long, long day. So, I already got some stuff done today, but tomorrow, like, once I finally get some rest, I'm going to wake up... Oh, yeah. Ah, that should come off perfect. That should be a blooper right there. I'm going to wake up and... Fuck. 300 episodes why I'm saying this I'm just like <sighs> what am I thinking why am I doing this and for what reason so there was that one time that I uh, I don't know I was a little drunk and the cow it was like cow tipping but like you know I thought I would do it from behind, like behind the cow, and, you know, a moo goes off, and, uh, ah, <sighs> shit. What's up, guys? It's Jimmy James, and this is the Jimmy James Show, coming to you Saturday at 8.30 p.m. We're going to be talking about weird shit. Be there. Or listen. I, whatever the fuck it is you do, just be there. Hey guys, what's up? It's the Jimmy James Show. Stay tuned. I'll be coming with you shortly. Um, with a new episode, just me again, uh, Saturday, probably Saturday night, I'm trying to shoot for, I don't know, anyway, you stay posted, when it's done, I'm sure if you're on your social media, you'll fucking pick it up, because you have nothing to do on your Saturday, but sit in and listen to stupid shit like this. 
Anyway, this is just a short trailer. Imagine if I talk like that all the time. God, I'd be rich with my super sexy voice coming at you. <laughs> Literally. And, I, and for the people who know me, yeah. No. I'm recording this because I am at a pivotal point in my life where I am stuck. I'm not even trying. I am just stuck. I don't know why I'm even recording this. <sighs> Do you ever just like, I don't know, as a podcast or a person, just hit a fucking wall in your life where you're just like, eh. But see, here's how I think. I'm trying to like just skip past all this bullshit that I'm thinking about. Like, you know, like, uh, oh my God, the meaning of life, blah, blah, blah. I always thank God I came up with that weird ass theory ID. Hey, I don't know. Or or you could do what most people do in America, and that, that I know, is say that, hey, it's fucking impossible. This shit can't be done. And it can be. That's a problem. But when you got $100 million given to you, almost anything is possible. Now, starting from zero or even a couple dollars, now that's a lot tougher. But now look what you said now. You said Trump went bankrupt and all this bullshit, right? No, well, I, I didn't say. I said, he's, I said he's been going bankrupt with things. I don't know. I don't read More than once. Now. More than once, yeah. So, Who do you think dug him out, himself or the people around him? I don't know. Do you know? <laughs> if he's bankrupt, ultimately he has to dig, dig himself out. People say, or, fuck you, you're, you're an asshole. But he already had people. He already had people behind the brand, dude. Like I told you, if you were going out and saying you took credit, if you were the guy in front of everything, I'm not going to come out and say, wait a minute, Dwayne, wait, Dwayne, Swade, Swade Podcast, and Swade Game, whatever you want to call yourself at that time, I'm not going to come out and dog you because I'm making money. If, oh, I take all the credit, I do all the sales, you know, that's the name. That's your household name. I'm not going to come out and dog you about it. We got to put somebody in front. But what if I'm a dickhead? I'm an asshole. Like right? Trump. Like, like Trump. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Hey, what's up, guys? This episode was from 2020. Uh, shit, sorry. My mic's making a little bit of noise there. Just wanted to fix it. I actually miss a lot of these conversations. Um, they got the... The quality got better. Oh, fucking mic. It's about time for a new mic. Um, yeah, so the quality got better, but I really wish I was listening to what he was saying more in the moment. My buddy. Um, I actually just talked to him not, not too long ago. Um, I'm giving a shout out to, uh, Swade. Swade be gaming. You know. Uh, he doesn't do podcasting, but he'll definitely come on the show. If I if I ask him, he'll definitely come on if he's not busy doing his gaming shit. Dude's a bowler in 2K, by the way. Gotta give him a shout-out. He could bowl. Um, yeah. Basically, all I wanted to say is I want to get him back on the show. We talked politics, but I think it would it, it was funny. In a way, because I had no real, I mean, I had a little bit of an idea, and here goes a guy who knows a lot about Trump. At the, this is at when you know he's president, and I'm just thinking like the average asshole. Oh, he's an asshole. This, that, whatever. So then, when we started talking about it, 
I mean, that's why I named the show Trump and whatever. By the way, this was, uh, uh, Jesus Christ, I even remember, like, I would have to look real quick, but, sorry, uh, Trump and whatever went, uh, Trump and whatever, (sighs) go to the place where it tells you the date it came out, what the fuck? Go to podcast, yeah. Go to go to episode. Well, that might help. Oh God, I got to my nose. Okay, it came out March fifteenth. Actually, it wasn't twenty 2020, twenty. It was twenty twenty one. So yeah, I just lied. So yeah, that's um, Trump and whatever with me and Swade. We talked, I'd say, over an hour. Yeah, it was an hour and a minute, seven seconds long. All right. Let's get on with the rest of this shit. It's taking me forever to put this shit together. And I'm doing it on a, my mic right now. The way I'm doing it is so bad. <laughs> this is terrible. All right. Here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, my first TikTok video. The video itself is not funny. It's ever lately. All right, so it it seems like I I pretty much have no idea what I'm doing. Um, what this amazing voice that um, I would say God, but uh, God didn't give me this voice. I think I I worked on it over time, and I just got better. Now with this time that I've had uh, this voice, I. Uh, Hold on, I'm just looking for something to eat here. Jesus Christ, I'm starving. Oh yeah, back to this thing. I'm doing a TikTok video. I mean, there's TikTok challenges and uh, I gotta run down and get ice. I honest, I don't, I don't get the point of anything anymore. Oh, I just bend down to look in the refrigerator. I open the door twice. Um. You know, I thought something different would happen to come out. Um, shit. You ever look in the refrigerator, shut the door, open it again, thinking a different result, and then get up, and I'll kind of show you what I'm doing, and you're just like leaning, thinking something different is going to happen. And then this is what you do. Look around the kitchen. And then you open the refrigerator door again. And then you just like kind of look in like this is a fucking science project. It's like you figure it out eventually. And then most likely you'll just eat the shittiest thing possible, stuffing your fat face, making that scale over there. It's kind of hidden away. Um, just go off its rock. And then you just realize, oh shit. Oh, I got cereal hidden away. Yeah. But then you realize, I don't know if that's enough to fill me. Dilemma. It's a fucking dilemma. You know you do exactly what I was talking about. All this bullshit I'm talking about. You've opened the fridge more than once. We know it. I know it. There's no need to deny it. You're all fridge reopeners all right enjoy the next part you know the whole time i was recording and i wasn't recording um the funny thing is i was talking about how i seen alter carbon you know um at first he was a chinese guy and then he was a white guy and he was a black guy that kind of tickles my gears I had an unrelated issue I haven't had a heart on in over 27 years, which I finally did 
But, uh, oh, my coffee's ready. That's how I started recording this. Oh, God. Ah, oh, Jesus Christ, I'm getting old. Hey, you believe I just turned 80? Oh, oh, shy. I just had to open up the pipes there. Anyway, getting back to Jesus Christ. I, I drink coffee. I, I use Mr. Coffee. And, uh, it's a coffee pot named Mr. Coffee. I don't call him Mr. Coffee. Oh, I forgot to stir my coffee. Doctor says I'm getting Alzheimer's, but I don't know. He gave me some pills. I just can't remember what I did with them. Oh, shit. That's hot coffee right there. Jesus Christ, I always forget, you know, stirring the coffee. I get burnt once in a while. Christ, I got to get paper towels. Uh, my life's going down the shit or something. Now, I went to see the doctor the other day. He started talking about all this nonsense like old age. I could have Alzheimer's. I don't know. He did something, but I forgot. All right, let's see if this coffee's... Ah, oh, shit, I just spilled some. Ah, fuck it, I get a little up to open this shit. <clears throat> you guys are probably still here wondering what will I say or do next. And, uh, you know, I see a lot of people out there. They got to clean the coffee I just spilled. <sighs> uh, uh, fucking juice. Oh, my knee. Oh, oh God. Anyway, I ought to cancel that culture. Hey, I guess I shouldn't be taking my time to drink the coffee. Mm. Ah, Jesus Christ. Well, I don't make too many Tic Tac videos, and I won't in the future. Anyway, whatever you do, don't smoke. And remember, Jesus Christ, you know, I figured I do one more of these because the kids today, they don't know, you know, diddly squat when it comes to, uh, you know, manners. Uh, back in my day, we had to ride horses to school through 10, 10 feet of snow, sometimes 20. I lived in a I lived in a place called uh, Turkey. Yeah, it was. It's way off the map there. Oh God, Jesus Christ! I think I gotta go uh, sit on the toilet and nuke nuke the power plant from my from my house. Oh God, just sitting here. Oh, God, anyway, I, sorry, I forgot what I was talking about. I believe that I was saying how uh, these Chinese people are taking over all our jobs. Well, let me tell you something. They are, and are definitely doing it. They're smaller, they're faster, they can get in and out of tight holes. Um... You know, just stuff that we just can't do anymore. And, and I was thinking, you know, we really got to do something that's going to impact the future of our uh, nation, you know, under uh, Bob and all that. And uh, I just realized the more I do these uh, little videos, um, the less I'm getting through. Hold on one second, which is, this is still hot. Part of my tongue last time. In fact, I got real scared. So I went to the doctor and he stuck a finger in my ass and he says, it's not looking good. And I said, for you? And he said, 
I, I can't remember what he said. He keeps telling me I'm forgetting things, but I don't know how to listen. The hell am I talking about again? Has it been... Is that the timer down there? Holy shit. God damn it. This is like a mirror. Oh shit, look at all that. Look at all that. I'm gonna take my teeth out. Alright, alright, alright. Oh, okay. Now now it wants to work. Ha! Fuck me in a bag of dicks. Ah, oh, fuck, my cigarette burned out again. Oh. Oh. I go through so many cigarettes. Just, like, they'll sit in the ashtray. I'll get one or two drags, and then it's like... Congratulations, you just figured out that you had one drag left. Yeah. See, I'm trying this, this set up tonight without... Is that loose at the bottom? You gotta be fucking kidding me. All these wires, I have, like, I have all these connections. And yesterday, I was at fucking Walmart, and I had this, this beat thing, or whatever. It wasn't about beats, but I can mute. The background noise and all that, and it was just, you hook a wire here, you hook a wire there, and that's it. Fucking done. And I mute when I don't want to talk, and then the rest plays. I don't have to sit there and mess around, upload, I can do it on just one app, not 16. <sighs> God. No, well, anyway, I came down here to do... I'm not even really into the mic. Like, now, now I'm talking into the mic. But, yeah. I don't even have to do this over fucking Audio Lab Pro. So, I'm going to switch over. Fuck me. Hey, what's up, guys? It's Jimmy James, and I'm here to talk about the universe. Yes, the universe. And beyond? <laughs> yeah. No. For the people who know me, um... I am AD, 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 I have the alphabet disorder disease, or what the fuck it's called. Uh, SHUT UP! Without getting off of topic. Starting this over. Uh, so, uh, yeah, I wanted to start this show. Uh, I don't know where the hell I'm at. I don't think I'm in my house anymore. Is this hell? Did somebody piss it? Now I gotta go pee. Now these voice changers are put. Did you hear that? I was like... It says like... It says a cave, but I don't... Wouldn't it be like... Why would it be water in a cave? I still don't get it. Um, don't you hate uh, when you are uh, doing something on a phone or something and somebody keeps hitting you up? Uh, I'm kind of going to get freaked out here. Can, can I go now? Hello? I don't think there's anybody there. Oh my god. I'm in my own hell. Hey, what up? This is Ronald. My name Ronald. I'm a, I'm a going to be a new guest on a Jimmy James show. Yeah, he got this guy here, he talk about everything, I mean, everything, shit, ain't none this cat don't know, you know what I mean, shit, anyway, it's Ronald, if I mentioned that already, anyway, uh, he talk about like that shit, and this, and this. The sky, like space and darkness and stuff, and like the beyonds in it, like yo, know, the limit shit. Anyway, this is this cat. Just click on that button. You know what to do, shit. Alright, it's one on my mouth. I'll talk to y'all later, shit. Do you ever have like one of those days where you kind of just like woke up in a bed? Place. Should probably get up so I'm not late. Okay, this just did on news you should definitely know. This would be my official new season. 
Number three to be official. Episode one is straight confidential. We're gonna be talking about astronomy, astrology, humanity, recovery. I would like to tell you a story, but not just any story, a story about a man who searched the internet to look for something wonderful, pleasureful, something to keep his mind at ease, but instead I found nothing but loneliness. People were boring until I came across a man named Jimmy James and his show called The Jimmy James Show Life and Beyond. This changed my way of thinking and I will no longer destroy the human race. I will let it live on because of this one in particular man. You were so close to annihilation. I was almost giving up on this human pettiness. But then I tuned in to the Jimmy James show and I found there is much glory to be won here on this planet. One word, one upload, one download at a time. We could change the course of human evolution. We could figure out how to come together in peace and harmony. And there is only one thing that can change this course of evil. And that is us. So let us stand and let us fight for what is right. And like always, take care of yourselves and one another. Alright, so that, that was from lines and stuff. There's a couple different things, but at the end of that part that I did, when I... Fuck it, Mike. I swear to God, like these are... I, I'm not even trying to do this. Like, I'm, I'm just trying to talk into the mic, but if I just tilt it, and it's like, I don't want to breathe into it. You hear, hear the crackling? It's driving me nuts. Alright, so, fucking mic. Anyway, uh, shit. Hang on. Honestly, I just stopped because I'm going to blow my nose. Okay, so what I was trying to say before I had to sneeze the sheets, at the end of that, Whatever that was, you know, we're like, I will destroy you and all that shit. My voice was going at the end. You can actually hear it start to go. But I only had a minute to do the skit. And, like, if you fuck up, you can't pause it, you know? So you have, like, one minute to do whatever you want. I don't have that anymore. I probably could get it back, but, yeah, whatever. I don't know. I will be getting a new piece of equipment. Um, I just gotta go get it. Or order it. But I'm not a lazy fuck like most of you. I probably will go get it, because that's what I'll do. I just won't hit, go to Amazon and be like, I'll have it delivered, you know? I don't know why I pay for Amazon Prime, but, uh, yeah. I'll definitely, most likely, go get it. I don't know what's coming up next, but, uh, <sighs> The editing I had to do just for this episode. I don't know if you people are worth it. Oh shit, did I just say that recording? Fuck. Hey guys, what's up? This is Jimmy James coming to you kind of live-ish. And uh, I want to see if you can hear this.
All right. So I, I don't give a shit. This is still whatever it's doing. So this is how I used to open. I think this is how I used to open my show. Like way before. I'd say I'd stopped in early 2021-ish. So this is the way it used to be open like almost all the time. Here we go. It is now time to explain to people just what's wrong with me. No, I'm just kidding. This is the Jimmy James Show. Welcome. Yay! So I was thinking. So I was thinking. And, uh, and, uh, and uh, that's when I stopped. That's when I stopped. This is Larry, the UFO hunter. Here to tell you a story, and also, maybe a close encounter. Pete, can you tell me your story? Yeah, first of all, uh, my name's uh, John. I'm here with Pete. Once again, that's John. That's incredible, Pete. I wondered, did the aliens abduct you or sexually assault you in any way? Uh, once again, I don't know if you can't hear me, um, I don't know what you mean by sexual, uh, se any sexual, why, why do you keep asking me about aliens? Slowly molested you. Uh, no, there was absolutely no sexual probing or any, any of this, did, uh, I'm a little confused. That is incredible. So they... No, wait, they... There's nothing incredible about any of this. I, I don't know what any of this is about. Literally, you called me, bud. Okay, well, what I'm trying to get at, uh, Larry, um... But, uh, listen, once again, my name's John. The last time I'm going to tell you this. Y y you've called me Pete. You've called Larry. Uh, isn't your name Larry? You called me. This is just incredible stuff. Listen, bud, I don't know what's going on. You called me. You told me, um, uh, you wanted to talk to me about some, uh, outer space UFO stuff. I'm an astronomer. I've been doing this for a long time, and, uh, pretty much we've gotten nowhere in the last, uh, minute here. I think maybe you are suffering from some sort of alien technology slash probing system. But for the last fucking time, I was not probed. I was not with any aliens whatsoever. They did not open up my asshole and go inside. I'm getting sick of you keep saying this. Um, what the hell do I... What else can I say here? This guy's just not listening. Right there. Thank you. R right there what? What are you talking about? Well, there you have it. He, he said it himself. What did I say myself? Buddy, you really got to get yourself a fucking, uh, a life. Ah, shit, this is me, isn't it? Fuck. Thank you for your confirmation, Larry, the UFO hunter out. Listen, wh whatever. Glad to help. Um, anyway, next time you call, uh, maybe I'll give you some detail about these aliens that fucked me up the ass. All right, take care. This cat, like, he be, like, saying things and, like, putting words in front of other words to make sentences. And, uh, I think, oh, by the way, this is Ronald, if I haven't mentioned that already, uh, yeah, he be like putting like, I don't know, words and shit together, so like maybe you should listen to him, but that's just my opinion, and anyway, Ronald out. I can, I'll add that in later, but uh, da, 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 da. But, yeah. but before we go on, I say, I, I say all of that to say this now, mm -hmm. because of your type of personality, right? Mm -hmm. How you're the kind of the, the bigger speaker, and I'm like the supporting, 
commentator. Yes. I think it should be like the Jimmy James show. Like the Howard Stern show. You know? Yeah, but you think... I guess when you think... Yeah, but I'm not trying to... Dude, if I ever blew up and I was... Like, I, I don't want to be... I want. I did this to really help my, not myself. Therapeutic. Talk. That's what the main goal was for. And I was like, shit. If I can help other people along, that was the main thing. And and you are helping me, you know. But and dude, that that's huge. Just there, right there. That's huge. You know. Because to be honest with you, um, there's certain, there's certain, we talk about a lot of similar things on our shows, you know. But I think the guests and certain things I want to bring on my show is going to be a little different. See, that's what I was going to ask you. you. You know, like, and by the way, uh, fuck, another another shout out because we're just just going on. Like, I would I usually welcome to the Jimmy Game Show and all that. I'll, I'll add that in. But um, be nice to your women. I can only talk for the men here. Be nice to your women, and they'll treat you right. You treat them right, they'll treat you right. You know what I mean? Don't be a dick. Don't be a douchebag. You probably won't really know what uh, half this shit is until probably after your fucking 28, 30s, I guess. After your 30s. Well over your 30s, you'll start to know what the fuck I'm talking about. <laughs> Took me a long time to figure a lot of shit out. If you're having a bad day. If you're having a bad day. It's one of my favorites. Like when you're having a bad day. Just like a shit day. Um... I watched this, so I was like, I don't know how this helps, things that I know. Um, just having one of those, it's not just a day, it's like a week, you know, sometimes when you're depressed and shit, you know, it just feels like going forever. I watched this, so I was like, I don't know how this helps, but you really gotta have some kind of brains behind it. It's only like a minute or two long, I'll tell you in a second. Life goes on without me, cause... If you build it, they will come. Well, he decided if he says it, you must listen. The Jimmy James Show. Facts and shit about weird shit that you wouldn't really realize unless you listen to them. Ah, uh, check it out. And here we go again. Uh, yeah. My name's, um, Jack. Uh, my name's Jack. Uh, last name is, uh, me. Me Roth. Yeah, Jack Me Roth. Um, yeah, I know, I get, I get a lot of stuff like Jack, Jack Me Off. I, I heard all the, the jokes, but it's, it's Jack Me, like me, M E H Roth. Like Me Roth. So, you know, uh, you know, Jack Me Roth. I know, it's, it's just different. Um, my middle, I mean, uh, I wanted to say, it, technically that's mi my middle name, is Jack Me Roth. Um, I, I, I don't know if I want to really get into this, but my last name is, uh, Sue Hard, but it's Sue Hard, you know, like Sue Hard. Yeah, so Jack Me Roth Sue Hard. That's, that's my name. Jack. Me off so hard. Okay, now I now I understand all all the uh yeah. Thanks for uh, listening to whatever I just said. Uh, this is in full. Jack me off so hard. <coughs> it was not me. Hey, what's up guys? It's Jimmy James, the host of the Jimmy James Show. I'm the creator, co-founder, founder, president, vice president, uh, custodian, coffee drinker, cigarette smoker, pipe licker. Mm. I was listening to other... Hey, what's up guys? Mm.
I was listening to other people's podcasts. This is a side thing before I get into this whole meaning thing. So a lot of people be like, Hey guys, what's up? This is such and such. I'm the host and creator, or I'm the creator, or, you know, it's like, whatever, dude. You know who the fuck you are. You just clicked on you. <laughs> you know? I think I know how to work out button. I think I know how my hearing works. Anyway, I, I'm not trying to get off track. I actually took me about 10 minutes to even start this because I fucked up a couple times and it's only like two or three bloopers, but they're not, you know, me trying to read. There's a blooper right there. Um, actually going to be taking this time. I should have had it ready, which I did have it ready. I wanted to talk about the meaning of stuff. What does it mean and all that shit, right? What's all the, um, the pretty shit behind life? Oh, God. Chest pain. Yeah, that would be my luck, right? So, guys, everything's going great. So, let me tell you about Alan Watts. It was a, it was a, oh, heart attack. That would be, like, my biggest show ever. Just me in the background. What was the first TVs came out, what, in the 30s? I think it was, like, 37? Something in that area. You know, it was the first show, but TVs didn't really start getting big until, what, the 50s? I mean, big. 60s? I mean, shit, I remember when I was young in the 80s. I mean, we had almost one TV in every bedroom. And they were like the short, fucking heavy ones, like 12-inch. You got a 12-inch? Oh, yeah. I just got a 16-inch. Yeah. Oh, my God. 16. Oh, my God. You're fucking living large. How's everybody's fucking week going? This is just a... uh I'm still here, podcast. I see that there's a lot of listeners. I don't understand why. What do you really want? What do you want from me? Why did I start this journey in the first place? I do some crazy shit on here, but it's not no technically funny. I don't know if it's funny. I always try to get a topic and I go from there. I don't know. One of those ruts where you don't feel like doing anything. I mean, you'll still do it. I'm not talking about work, and I'm talking about like your odds and ends, like hobbies, podcasting, shit like that. <laughs> oh, I'm so bad. Like you're gonna go be a cashier somewhere? No, I'm good. No, there's nothing wrong with working. <laughs> no, not like on your body. While you're sitting there thinking, like, what does he mean, the asshole or the cunt? No, I'm talking about like, what's these meanings? You ever see somebody give you the finger? It's just like, yeah, and... <laughs> that's that's a wave in Philly. If you went downstairs, you're fucking half out of it. You're just... Now, picture this. You're awake, you're awake now. So, like... Yeah, but I want you to picture this since I'm just going on with nonsense words at this, this fucking time. You're waking up. You're going downstairs. Ah, oh, fucking fresh pot of coffee. You know it's there. And then somebody comes in, swoops in, fucking just pours it all in their cup and leaves, dude. Like, that's it. There's no more coffee. You don't have no more coffee. That was it. You, you fucking loaded it in, right? That was your fucking coffee. You pre-made that the night before or whatever the hell your coffee maker fucking works. And, like, do you know how upsetting that is? T to people where I'm from, that, that's like killing somebody like that's the state of fucking madness you get in is like you want to i get so much incoming spam does anybody else get incoming spam on their phone <laughs> getting back to that yeah coffee rich people pricks dicks cunts assholes uh it's all relates to the same thing did you ever give a shit up Sent you a firm. Yeah, I guess so many of these fucking firm requests get out of here. Um, do you ever see, uh, you ever see how your coffee's made? Do you, are you, are you the type of people like, oh, wait, I grind my own coffee beans. I grind them myself. Do you really? Do you grow them in your garden too? Shut the fuck up. Stop saying that. Anyway, like, I don't need difficult. Yeah! Fuck 
this episode. This I got emotional damage. In a minute, um, a lot's been going on. Man, I want to throw you in on. By the way, like, happy birthday! You can put this in your message to our listeners. Um, tell them I said hello. I, I think about y'all, you know, and your listeners every day. Hope they're all doing well. Um, hopefully, better than I am right now. I right, mean, um, love to you, your listeners, your all your your family and everything. Um, and I will talk to you later, my friend. Alright, love y'all. Bye. What's up, my brother from another mother? Um, just wanna call and just say hi, check in on you. I'm gonna be kinda of busy today, so I may not return any calls today. Just wanna let you know too that the um newish um Doc and Dan show stuff with um Ronnie, but some people said they can hear um us talking on it, some people said they can't. I don't know if they go to YouTube or what. But I listened to it the other night and I couldn't hear anything. I listened to it today and I could hear part of the conversation, so but I thought you got the four fifteen views and that doesn't have any vocals on it, some people are telling me. So uh, just check it out. Even if you can't hear nothing, still give it a thumbs up, a like, and maybe a comment on it. Yeah, I love y'all and I'll tell you later, man. So no. I really think about about like now that I'm just thinking I had two fucking trash bags stuff you had two trash bags full of brand new stuff what was in the trash bags and fucking amazon and would you like to make a formal complaint sir 911 what is your emergency you had two trash bags of brand new stuff do you hear how insane that sounds right trash bags two trash bags two trash bags of Stuff I put out for trash. He put stuff out for trash. Okay, I just want to make sure that was working. So now I can record on here and here, so that's like a backup. And then I can record it there, to there, to there, to there. It just goes on forever. Yeah, this, and then I can have one that... Okay, so while we're talking... I don't really need this. This is just like a backup thing if I wanted to add something later. So... Like I could say, um, like we like we could do any skit. Like I could now see what I like recording. So I'm like, um, all right. So like for instance, it'd be me. So we're all right. We're ready. So nine one one. What's your emergency? Yeah, I got a guy tied up on the roof. He says he's in dire trouble. He says uh, if he don't get out of here right away, this bomb's going to go off. Uh, Okay, so where are you located? Sir, I'm on top of a building. Yes, where at, sir? On the highest part of the building. I understand that, sir. The highest part of what building and where? It's at the highest part of the building on the corner of Grant and Steven Sin. So the highest corner building of Grant and Stevenson. Are you at the Grant and Stevenson building, sir? Yes, I am. Aren't you a detective? This guy is uh, about to die. His vest says three minutes left. What do I, what do, I do here? Do I run? Do, what do I do? No, sir, don't run. Is there anything you can do? Uh, no, I am... I, that's the whole point of me calling you, so you can come out here and help me defuse this bomb. So, okay. All right, we'll have, we'll have guys out there right away. All right, so uh, I'm doing this with a new recorder. I don't know what you can and cannot do. The Monday... What is it? Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays? Mm-hmm. Give or take a day. So I want to do these podcasts three times a week, which is uh, just, you know, mentally crushing. And I'm spiraling out of control, going into the pits of nowhere. Anybody want to come with me? 
so this podcast was supposed to be about uh, podcasting five through six or seven, but I decided to take a detour. I'll do. Uh, let's see. So I've been smoking cigarettes since I was about I don't know nine. <laughs> That's a long fucking time. So you're probably thinking, what's today's agenda? I ain't got nobody. Um. Do you think getting back in the podcast a but do you think it's probably better to have somebody on the show with you? Yeah. Sometimes I just uh, want to come on here and vent. Like, I don't know what I have to do yet. Nobody's reached out to me. Uh, I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. She want to put me on her comedy. I'm like, comedy? The show is social and whatever the fuck social studies at. Or what was it? Social? It's not comedy. It's A to Z. It's about everything. We can get funny on here. We can get really fucking loopy funny. We, we. I got a fucking crew working over here. And yeah, Jeremy, hit the button. Hit the button. So, yeah, I bought a... Uh, changing the subject really quickly and fast. Fish oil, GNC. Fish oil, GNC. I bought it. GNC, Mega Man. Bought it. Yeah, one a day, one a day, and fish oil. Don't know why I went in that store and bought it, but I realized I haven't gone in GNC like ever before. Who the hell goes in the GNC store? So I actually went in there and started talking to the dude who was in there. He's a cool dude. I forget his name. Uh, anyway, I walked out. They wanted to hire me or something after like 25 minutes of being in there. I got a call from like the, uh, the fuck you call that? The, um, People, district ma- district manager. They don't do commission. They wanted to hire me. I'm like, all right. Well, the pay was terrible. I feel bad for anybody who has to get up out of bed for that. Uh, I would definitely not. I have to do a pop. I was literally thinking to myself, fuck. I have to do a podcast for Friday. Ah, shit. Am I done? Wait. What's up, guys? This is Jimmy James. Just one more thing. If you listen to me on this, Spotify, Anchor, any platform you're on right now, you can also follow me on YouTube, Twitter, whatever, Facebook. Like I said, you could do it all. You can go on there. You can like me. You can hate me. You can dislike, approve, unapprove, whatever. Whatever you think I need to do to approve or to get your approval. That's all I'm looking for. That's all I care for. I just care for your approval. But for now, this is me just saying goodbye. Bye, world. Okay, Jim, I'll see you around. Where are you going? No! Oh, no! Oh, that's not what I thought he meant by that at all! Goodbye, everybody. <laughs>